Hey guys, it's Strange. I'm Jake with Han Toy Care Automotive in Boulder, Colorado. Today, part of our preventative maintenance series, we're going to show you how to adjust rear drum brake systems. So on these types of drums, they don't have an adjustment on the back and then they're used to the faces kind of mating together. So what they do is they create these head screws so that way you can drill it in and it pulls the drum out. Should never be that easy. So this is your adjustment nut. This is what's gonna set the pad difference. That'll allow this to mate with the drum. This pad thickness is more than enough. Bare minimum in the rear is two millimeter. So this is right here at the two millimeter mark. We would may replace them, but this one can go for a little while longer because they've been out of adjustment for a while. And you can tell by the way the uh, debris is built up. See how it's kind of clean underneath that? These haven't been self-adjusting like they should have. If it's wet. So we have a leaking wheel cylinder. That's not supposed to be wet under there. Like it's supposed to be dry like that. So this wheel cylinder is no good. So what we're trying to do is widen this out so that it marries with the drum. And we do a couple clicks to check the adjustment. If we um, replace hardware, replace shoes, replace whatever, um, we would lubricate everything and then that adjustment would actually be dialed. It takes a while to get a feel for it. In modern day, we use brake drum mics to make sure that the pad size is the right size. 